Hi folks, Eric with Bailey Industrial. We're going to discuss the PT510. We're going to go over some of the basic controller options on here. So let's get to it. So the main function we're going to talk about to start is the manual mode screen. To get into manual mode, we're going to go to F2. And that takes us into our manual mode screen. Here we can move the gantry of the machine around and only in this screen. To move the gantry around, we're going to use our arrow keypad over here. Move the machine left to right, forward and back. There are two speeds to do this in. Right now it's in its slower speed setting. We can go into a high speed setting if we want to traverse all the way across the table a little quicker. We can go to H speed, which is F3 here. That highlights. Now we are in high speed. Now the gantry will traverse twice as fast as in the slow speed. To get out of that, we simply hit that F3 button again and that shuts off that function. To adjust our auto height or the torch cutting height, uh, that is all done down here on this part of the controller. And what we're going to do here is we're going to do a touch off. This is corresponding with your Z height. The arrow up raises your torch up, the arrow down brings that torch down. To adjust that height as to how high it will be cutting off the material, that is your IHS height control knob here. As you turn it more to the plus value, it's going to increase your height. As you turn it to the minus side of that value, it's going to slowly decrease that height or cut closer to the plate. When you make an adjustment on that dial, It'll show up here on the digital screen. You can see the six that it's going to, and then five. It takes just a second for it to adjust, and the height is adjusted. And that's all going to be based off of your thermodynamics uh, cutting book that you get with your machine and your power supply. Then once our machine is set, we got the torch height set, the cutting height is set to the right height for the material. And we have the machine in the general corner that we'd want to start in. We want to zero our X and Y axis. And to do that, we're going to hit F4. And that's going to zero these two coordinates here. And now the machine has got its origin. Another valuable feature of manual mode is manually cutting or articulating the gantry to make a manual cut. And to do that, you would hit the number four key on the keypad here, and that's going to turn this button on here, which means arc on. You'll turn the plasma on, the plasma will start firing. Then at this point, we can now go into our high speed mode, F3, or just stay in our low speed mode and do a manual cut across the sheet and rip off that excess skeleton that's left over. So very helpful. Then when you want to shut that arc off, Hit number four and that shuts that arc off. You have to be kind of careful. You're manually moving everything. You're manually turning the torch on. So you want to make sure not to collide or hit anything on the table.